<clears throat> Excuse me. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. I think we can, uh, might as well get started. Whoa. Wait. Shit. <laughs> Wire there. Oh, that's not our save. I see. I see. Yeah. This, this is the one I want. For sure. For sure, for sure. Oh, it's hot in here. Gotta open a window. Ooh. Uh, let's see. Howdy, Luke Gavin. Thanks for joining us. We're playing some more Judgment tonight. We're, uh... I don't know if you were here for uh, the first part of this, but we're, uh... We're a former lawyer, now a uh, private detective in, uh, um, in Japan. We're, uh, this, uh, this, uh, place called Kamarucho. Kamarucho? I'm not sure how it's exactly pronounced. I forget what I'm supposed to be doing at the moment, though. So, uh, which direction? This, yeah, I was going the right direction. Never mind. Okay. E. It's, uh... I don't know if you're familiar with the Yakuza games at all, but it's, uh... Set in that same universe. It's kind of like, uh... Action, martial arts, beat-em-up, RPG... Like, you're wandering around, uh... Like, there's all kinds of mini-games and shit to do. And uh, all kinds of, like, side quests. Like, this, uh... The series is known for, um... For all of the, uh... Just little shit that fills the world, you know? Um... And everything... Everything in the series, uh... Takes place in this, um... This one... This one city. Camar uh, Camarocho, right? Um, yeah. Usually you're, you're, you're a Yakuza, but this time you're, uh, not. Though, you do have Yakuza connections, so. Where am I going? This is where I'm going. No, I want, that's where I want, oh, shit, punks. Okay, we're gonna... Yeah! Get him! Ah, oh, dick. Oh, I'm in the wrong one. I'm in the... Well, doesn't matter now. There's only one guy left. Nope. Wrong stance. It doesn't matter. Fuck it. I can, get, I can kick his ass regardless. There we go. Yeah. I'm really enjoying this game so far. The characters are great. The, uh... The gameplay is really satisfying. Yeah. The story is interesting too. Oh, who's calling me? What's up? Me. You in KJR yet? Looks like it. <clears throat> Where are you? I'm on the opposite group. Look up. Okay, let me let me know, let me look. Opposite roof. There? Oh yeah, there he is. There's Kaido. There he is. That shirt's just like a homing beacon. <laughs> I see you. Be up in a sec. Alright, how do I get up there? 
here. Ah, stairs, I see. Oh, an elevator. Not an elevator? That's not an elevator. That is a... I don't know what that is. I could probably read the sign there, but... Top floor, please. Or roof, I guess. I guess we're going to the roof, not the top floor. Still not it. Wow. Lots of stairs. Oh, I can run up these stairs. Okay. Oh, hello. That's the, the that's the that's the door I'm looking for. Okay. Wait a second. Can I just climbed up here? What? Blasted. Oh well. That's fine. Yo. Hello, you. You say? Too bad the place is absolutely crawling. The Yakuza. Guess this is the Cure hideout after all. No doubt. And Marase? Couldn't find it. I looked pretty damn hard at the drone, too. Hmm. You sure it was hard enough? Uh, sure. <laughs> Let's try again. I'll fly it this time. When you want something done, do it yourself, right? Sure, you ass. <laughs> um. Okay. You need to pick flight to fly the drone, huh? Uh huh. This here is Marasa. All right. I wonder if we can just peek through the windows, see if we can find it. Uh. Okay. I think I got it. Um. Um, I think I got it, yeah. Uh oh. Okay. Hmm. Ah, hold still. What the hell? Jeez, I don't know what that was. There we go. Suspicious. What the hell? Suspicious. Dude. There we go. What's with the book? Don't these guys have anything better to do? Apparently not. Ah, there we go. That's how I control the altitude. Very good. <clears throat> oh shit. Running into things. No. Oh, wait, wait. Suspicious. What the Hold up, hold up. That's him. We got our guy. He's kicking somebody's ass, looks like. Okay. Shit. Wait inside. Let's try and figure out where to. All right. Can I fly in there? Is that window open? No. I mean, it is open, looks like, but can't fly in there. Let's see over here. Uh huh. No windows over here. Okay. Hmm. Up here. Do you go in here? I don't see him in here. Oh, wait, yes, yes, there he is. Come here. Suspicious. What the? Gotcha. There he is. Well fucking done, man. Okay. Now what? <clears throat> Think they'd let us meet him? I don't know about that. <laughs> Especially if we told them why we're here. We'll need to find another way in if we want to put the squeeze on the Rasa. Agreed. What are you thinking? 
Oh, there's a few options on the table. As for the best one. Hmm. Sneak in a window, put on the skies. Um uh, I don't know. Sneaking could be fun, but I want to put on disguise. Maybe I could go undercover. Oh yeah? Who has? I was thinking pizza delivery. You ever seen a pizza guy get invited inside? Right. Forget the pizza. What about some kind of repairman? Now you're talking my language. They've got jumpsuits over at Don Quixote. Wow, they got everything over at Don Quixote. You can't show up and expect them to just let you stroll on in there. True, huh? I think I've got it. Huh? What would they do if the heater broke? Call a repairman, obviously. Are you suggesting we just wait till it breaks? I don't know. Maybe we could speed things up a bit. Never thought I'd see the day you came up with a plan like that. Who are you? And where'd you bury Tuck's body? <laughs> if I told you, I'd have to kill you. <laughs> anyway, I love them. Make things a little chilly for these KJ guys. You keep watch, okay? Sounds good. Let's do this shit. <clears throat> okay. Oh wow, he just slides right down. That's nice. Shouldn't I get the jumpsuit first? Oh. Nope. Can't get can't do it that way. Just gotta walk through the fence like a lame-o. Damn it's locked. I guess I'll have to pick it. Huh, who's texting me? Cops are heading your way. Finish what you gotta do. Uh, quick. Shit. On the unscrupulous picking of locks. Lock picking is a questionable yet sometimes necessary measure for opening locked doors. Use a pick to adjust the notch of the pins so they line up with the sheer line colored red. Each pin is set up, has a set position of. Uh, that's actually a pretty, pretty realistic. Um, lock picking. Stupid. Oh shit! Oh, I suck at shit. Why am I bad? Oh, I stupid shit. What? Oh, I suck at this. Shit! Stupid. Oh, I suck at this. What? Ah. Shit. Nice. Stupid thing. Nice. Stupid thing. I don't understand. Stupid thing. Nice. Stupid shit. Huh? I don't see where the shield line's supposed to be. Stupid shit. Why am I stupid thing? I suck shit. I suck at this. What? Shit. Um, you can open the lock by aligning all the, if you hold the pin too high, all the pins will set. Oh, I gotta do it slow. Oh! Oh, I see. Almost there. That'll there we go. There we go. Hello, Mayo. How my brain sounds every day. <laughs> All right, let's bust up some heaters. One way to do it, I guess. There, there. No way they're fixing that without a pro. Now for my disguise. Don Quixote, here I come. Alright. Get out of the way! Beat it, punks! Alright. 
They really do have everything at Don Quixote. All right, I, I gotta talk to like, all right. That's how these games work. Welcome, sir. Work clothes purchase. Oh. Yes, there we go. What's up? Checking in. You get the goods? Yeah, I'm heading back now. Better hurry. The plan's working. KJR's chilling out over here. We just called a repair. Perfect. I'll be there as soon as I can. Beautiful. Oh wow, I can actually just play this in first person. At least this part, like, I can run around in first person. That's nice. I mean, it's nice to have the option. Not something I'm gonna do, but... Good to know. Here? Here. That's where I'm supposed to go? No? I'm confused. Oh, am I supposed to go back up on top of that? Oh, yeah, I'm supposed to meet him upset. Okay. I see. There we go. I'm ready. Good change, then, would you? Okay, okay. Now to get into the dump jumpsuit. About disguises, you can mask uh, Yagami's identity with various disguises at certain points in the story. Simply use the uh, the items app and navigate to the disguises tab. If you ever have the proper disguise, get if you mu you must. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, interesting. This will work. I know you're in a disguise and all. But don't let your guard down, okay? Try to blend in. Who do you think you're talking to? Uh -huh. Okay. Prepare, man. To the rescue! I'm heading into a Yakuza hotbed. You need to make sure I don't... Well, I don't know. First thing first. Gotta get past reception. Hi there. I heard you're having some heater trouble. I'm here to fix it. Yes, it seems to have stopped. Thank you for coming on such short notice. The main unit is just out the door to the left. Right around the emergency stairwell. Uh... Mind if I take a look at an indoor unit as well? These things can be pretty complicated. Is that really necessary, sir? It'll help me get a better idea of the whole system. I'd rather not bore you with the specifics. Very well, then. Sure. There's one in the security office to your left. Thank you very much. I'll have you guys heated up in no time. to investigate for the fucking light switch. Alright, time to look for the blueprints. Howdy, Frog Senpai. How's it going? How was your day? Um, boy, howdy. Here? Um, where on earth would, would I find blueprints? Doesn't seem like a very blueprinty place. Um, nope. I 
am very lost. Why is nothing showing me I can interact with it? I see nothing to... That would, uh... Where? Son of a bitch. I really hope there isn't any time a timed aspects to this. Because that would, um... Like, no hidden timers, because that would bug, bug the crap out of me. I don't need that stress. Fuck. Maybe I should have just snuck in through a window, damn it. <laughs> I'm searching! Shut up! What do you want from me? I can't open any of these fucking cabinets or anything, so... How am I supposed to find blueprints if I can't rummage? There's nothing blueprinty on these desks. What's this? Not a blueprint. Hmm. Not a blueprint. Any of these blueprints? These do not look like blueprint cabinets. Any of this? Come on. Very chill and relaxed. I took it easy today. Right on, right on. Um, is this a blueprint? That's not a blueprint. What is he saying? I can't hear him. I really am... What? Where the fuck do you want blue... Where the fuck would blueprints be? Oh, is that a blueprint? Hey. Jesus, I fucking looked at that already. Why didn't it... I examined that already. Why didn't it fucking work, man? Okay. Uh, looks like you need a key to get to uh, to the stairs on the third floor. I won't be able to get uh, get to the room uh, Murris, uh, Murris eyes in. Gotta find a key somehow. <clears throat> this is the security room, so the key might be around here. I should take a look around. <clears throat> Blasted. Yep, sneaking in a window would have been a better idea. I regret this decision. What the? What's this? You left the key out on the desk. Uh, you've got to keep it locked under high security. I put it away for you this time. You know what will happen if you do it again. Huh. Guess the key's in this room somewhere. No idea where, though. I'll have to look for it. All right. It's under lock and key, eh? High security. Suspicious. A safe, huh? The note on the desk said to keep the key under high security. Not much higher security than a safe. Let's see here. Damn, I need the code. Hopefully there's a clue to the password somewhere around here. Well, I know... Somebody's foolish enough to write down a four-digit code. Wait, is this... Is this the code to the safe? Well, worth a shot. I thought I saw another sticky note somewhere. But I could, I could be wrong. I thought I saw it. Five o three eight, pasta. Howdy. Welcome. How are you doing today, pasta? Five o. No. Damn it. Five o. Stop that. Three eight. 
Whoa, it worked. Cool. Yeah. Great. This will get me th get me through to uh, Marise. Now I just have to find him. Cool. Uh, all right, time to head for the fire escape. Should be just to the left of this room. Very good. Still broken. No, no real repairman in sight. Sorry, pal. I don't. I was looking for. Here to fix the heat, yeah. Got something I need you to check out. Oh, all right. No problem. Come on, this way. Just woke up, my dude. Right on, right on. Did you have good sleep? There it is. Power's on and all, but nothing's happened. Hmm. Let me see what I can do. I can't believe I'm doing this. I'm just trying to learn more of the avatars. Right on. Yep. Yeah, this thing's seen better days. Thanks, Sherlock. Can you fix it? Hey, genius. If you're gonna fix it, don't you need to take the panel off first? on it <laughs> glad I could be of service now if you'll excuse me I have other repairs to make <laughs> that's fucking great <laughs> what uh, what are you trying to do with the avatars my dude uh, who are you oh I'm uh, here to repair the heater sir Weird. You ain't the usual guy. Where's our man, huh? Never had anyone else come for us. Oh, uh, about that. You know what? I'll just give him another call. See what's up with uh Oh. Us. Hmm. That's a good question. I don't know how I'm going to get myself out of this. Um... I got plastic surgery um, from a different company. I'm just filling in. Oh, the guy we normally send out here is sick today. I'm handling things in this place. Funny. I just got off the phone with him. Sounded an awful lot like he uh -oh. was on his way over. Well, that's odd. He must have gotten better, I guess. Damn it, he talked to the guy on the phone. I should have come up with something better. Like what? Suspicious as shit. I bet he's a Tojo spy. Oh shit. Uh oh. Right. Come on, boys, let's take him down. Well, shit. Oh boy. Finding a bunch of Yakuza in a small room is uh not my idea of a not my idea of a good time. But we're uh, gonna go for it anyways, I guess. Okay. Beautiful. Shit, well, this could have gone better. Not ideal. Phew, made it out. I should get it moving before the whole building catches on to me. Yeah. 
I'd say. Alright. No, I guess I was supposed to be in there. Never mind. What the heck? Ah. Stairs. Um, here. No. Here, I guess. Uh, wait. What about the third floor key I found in the security office? Uh, that might, it just might do the trick. Master the keys to unlocking. Simply use the correct key is, uh, sim simple, simply using the correct key is one method of opening, opening a locked door. Out of all the keys you own, choose the one that fits the keyhole and press the corresponding button. If you choose the correct key, the door will open. If you choose the wrong key, the door will stay closed and you have to choose a key again. Um, okay. Uh, this one? Got it. Yeah, that one. Beautiful. Hmm, this door wasn't on the map. Why are Yakuza offices always so confusing? Either way, the key from before won't work up here. Uh-oh. Guess I'll have to pick the lock. Great. Should've just... Climb through an open window. Um, I think I want to do this one first. Stupid thing. Nice. Ooh. Almost there. There we go. Yeah. Shit. Ah, fuck. Come on. Come on, get it. Oh, I suck at this. Go. Do it. Right nice. there. Thank you. Almost there. Okay. Perfect. Yeah. I wish I was that good at lockpicking in, in real life, man. What the? There aren't any stairs up. This isn't the top floor, though. I need to find a way to uh, Murase. Dirty door for a reception room. No way I'm getting getting in there without a code. No sign of Murase either. Gotta keep moving. Alright. Hmm. Oh, I remember there's a... That also has a code. There's a, uh... Yeah, there's a ladder out here. I saw it with the, uh... When I was flying around with the drone. And there's my way up. Beautiful. Hey, yeah. The fire escape's just over there. Uh, my way down to the fifth floor. Not sure what's going on, but those guys look busy. I should try and sneak by around them if I can. What the fuck were you thinking? Please, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. All right. Uh, where to now? Am I following the arrows? Is that what's going on here? Okay, now to climb the fence. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Shit. The hell you doing? Who the fuck? Damn it. <laughs> well, <laughs> Shit.
Man, this uh this Josh is going going off the rails. <laughs> he passed out from sheer terror. Oh great, now I have to kick all of their asses. Oh boy, this is a lot of a lot of people to beat the shit out of. Ugh. Wow, he really likes the block, huh? Probably gonna need to hit him with something. Okay, come on. Screw you guys. There we go. Pasta, are you familiar with these games at all? The Yakuza games? Ooh, what? What was that? This isn't a Yakuza game, but it's in the same. Not really, never played it, never played them. Yeah, this is a... This isn't exactly a, a Yakuza game, this is a, a spin-off of the series, but... This is this is my first real uh, playthrough of anything in the... in the... in the world, in the... in that universe. Um, they're, uh... They're like, uh, martial arts beat-em-up, um, RPGs. You might enjoy them, I don't know. But there's like a bunch of, uh... Side stuff like they're they're known for having a really full world of, of shit to do, you know. But I got a call about a broken heater. I told you, we figured it out. All fixed. Nothing to see here. Can Kaido for the win. To make sure everything's okay. Oh, and I'll need you to sign this too. I'm not signing shit. You didn't even fix anything. Now get the hell out of here. Huh? <laughs> actually. Could I borrow your restroom? I'm not feeling so good. Shit yourself for all I care. What? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking love Kaido. He's a gem. All right. Now for the real, the real dish. <clears throat> oh, well, guess I'm kicking some more ass. So much ass kicking going on. Uh, usually in these games you're a, a Yakuza, um, but this time you're in this, in, uh, hence why the series is called Yakuza. Um, but this is, a. Uh, this is a, uh, since this is a spin-off, you are, in fact, not Yakuza. You are, um, you're a, a private detective who was, a, a disgraced lawyer. And, uh, yeah, you get to do a bunch of ridiculous shit like that. Shit. Oh, get off. Fuck off. There's a but this these the series is known for uh for uh amongst other things it's it's wild. Um <laughs> It's wild uh, weapon uh, finishers or whatever they're called. I don't like they get they can get you can pick up all kinds of shit and beat the crap out of people with them, and the uh, the animations are get are can get really fucking wild. Uh, 
There we go. I don't know why I'm so good at fighting, though. I, I'm not. I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure how he, how this guy got to, to this level. Of uh, skill. You'll be. Uh, you will receive a mortal wound when stabbed, shot, or hit with deadly attacks performed by enemies with intense aura. Though mortal wounds can be restored by eating or using recovery items, you can treat them by either visiting a doctor somewhere in Camarocho or using a medical kit. Okay. XP boost. After charging up X the X gauge... Or, the X boost. Oh. The EX gauge. Press R2 to activate the EX boost. During EX boost, your attack speed... Mm hmm... Interesting. Alright. Still kick your ass. There we go. Oof. Oh, shit. He's got a... Oh, I see the problem. I see the issue now. Alright. What is this? Yes. Oh, fuck. Ah, crap. Oh, shit. Whoa, oh, 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 oh! Didn't like that. Shit. Ah, ah! I was pushing the wrong button. I meant to block. But I locked on instead. Shit, 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 shit! Fuck this. Come here, you bastard. Lock onto him. Damn it. I was going to smash him with the chair, but that looks like that's not happening. Fuck. Looks like we need more health. Hold on. Hug bomb alpha. Experience a hug in liquid form. Oh, I got two of these, so I'll use one of them. Perfect. Uh, I wanted to grab this. Yeah, there we go. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. Shit. Fuck you, come on. Oh! Boy, howdy. Ah! Get away, get away! Go away! Shoo! Ooh, fuck. There we go. is you running away after abandoning Kume. Who do you think you are? I'm a local detective. Hamura's lawyers have me look into Kume's murder. So what? You're defending Hamura. 
You think I'm gonna tell you shit, asshole? I already beat the shit out of you. You wanna go again? You're not getting out of this unscathed, you know. I know your face now. Do you really think Hamura killed Kume? Of course I do. Who else could be? That's what I'm trying to find out. I need to know what happened that night. It's as clear as day. Hamura gouged Kume's eyes out. End of story. That's not what I'm asking. Yeah. Where? How? In the dump behind a morgue. The bastard tortured Kume to death. Actually, the murder happened somewhere else. And I have the evidence to prove it. Uh... Location of the body and the murder scene aren't the same place. This proves it. Um, let's see. Take a look at this. What the hell? That's Kume. That's right, there's a hint in this picture. Kume's body was moved here after he died. There was something in this picture that showed that. The lack of blood? Why Why do I have to... <laughs> I already figured this out. What Seriously, come on, man. Suspicious. No signs of blood on the ground. That's it. Yeah. Sure, this is tough to look at, but as you can see, there's almost no blood around his body. That means he was killed somewhere else, then transported to the alleyway. Oh, I guess so. It doesn't add up, does it? So, you ready to talk now? Hmm. I think I can finally get to the main topic now. Okay. All right. Let's take it from the top. Now. After you ran away from Amor, where exactly did you go? You couldn't just let them take Kume, could you? Yeah, I had to do something. So, I went to round up the rest of the clan. We had to take Kume back. But nobody would help, would they? You kidding? Of course they helped. We burst in there ready to bust heads. When was that? Nobody else went in or out of the moor. What? You mean because the camera didn't see anyone? <laughs> Funny thing, man. Turns out you can't get seen if the camera's broken. Ah, so we went to the back. Was our ticket in. So you really went inside? Yup. Not a soul in the house, though. Trust me. We searched the whole damn joint. And when hmm. was that? Just after midnight, I suppose. Right when the prosecution says Hamura was laying into Kume. If you're telling the truth, that's a clear contradiction. Huh. Who gives a shit what the prosecution says? Hamura killed Kume, and that's that. Ain't no other way. Maybe so. But the police still need to hear your story. If you could just testify to that... You gotta be kidding me. Why the fuck would I do that, huh? Can't force him to testify. Nothing I can do about that. Yeah, it was worth a try. Yeah, fair. <laughs> nice work. So well, busts into a mall. turned out for... Who's he fine? Absolutely nobody. Yep. Captain Hamura said he kicked Kume out and hit the sauna right around midnight. The stories match up. You really think he's innocent? Not sure. Our next step is finding proof he was at that sauna. Guess that's that. Well, I'm pooped. How about we call it here? And a good call. I'll see you tomorrow, Kaito-san. All right.
Let's see. Ah, I see. Okay. Yeah. Oh, these are the ones I can buy. Ah, okay. Yes. Okay. Um, boost attack. Ooh, balance of the tiger. Yagami will be, le will be less likely to falter from enemy attacks while in tiger style. Um, uh, that sounds good. Yeah. Cool. Uh-huh. Let's let's do some of the uh, let's try it. let's uh, wander about the city a little bit and do some of these um no wait that's not where I want do some of these uh, mini games and side stuff let's investigate the world a little bit this is not where I thought it was no this is a game okay. Okay, so I just go up to a table and... Interesting. Has our table piqued your interest? You'll need uh, 50,000 yen to a bet to join us. Oh, I don't have 50,000 to... I also don't know how to play Mahjong. I don't think I have that either. Right? Um, yeah, no. <laughs> I'm broke. I'm pretty broke. Eight thousand yen is uh not a lot. Not a lot at all. What's this place? Nope, can't go in there. Where's that? Oh, it must be for right next to it, I see. Um, no. Weird. Okay. I don't know what that, I don't know what that marker is. I can make a friend here. Let's make a friend. A sushi chef. Welcome, welcome. Can I take your order? Hmm. Let's see. What kind of ramen? Oh, he's a. It's a ramen place. It's even better. Hmm. Oh well. Let's see. What kind of what kind of ramen do I want? Chashu, stewed pork. Um, we'll do that, and, uh, some gyoza. Oh, okay. Fine. All right. Good stuff. Back to it. Thank you very much. Come back again. Mmm. Compliments to the chef. Why, thank you. Yeah. Seriously, your chashu was incredible. Oh, yeah? Glad to hear it. A lot of people compliment our ramen, but to be honest, not too many people mention our chashu. Huh? Wonder why. It's the strangest thing. We put just as much effort into our chashu as that we do our ramen. That's probably why it tastes so good. Ha! Then I'll, then I'll let you in on a secret. We do add a special little ingredient that you probably wouldn't expect. Oh? And what would that be? Take a wild guess. 
Hmm. hmm. Can I get a hint? Ah, ha, ha. All right, then. Let's see. Normally, you'd add sugar to sweeten up chashu, but here we use something else. What do you think that could be? Hmm. A substitute for sugar? Huh. Uh, oh, well, I would use honey. Honey? Aha! You must have quite a refined palate to figure that one out. With the right amount of honey, you can make nearly any cut of meat drip with sweet, tender goodness. I see. Now that you mention it, that chashu was dripping with sweet, tender goodness. Ha ha ha, indeed. Say, what's your name? This is Yagami. I'm Yagami. It's nice to meet you. Yagami-san, huh? The pleasure's all mine. Hope to see you around more often. You bet. See you next time. Yeah. Sounds good. I'll see you later, pal. I mean, what better friend break up the uh, the meat's proteins? Yeah, that's true. It does. You're right. That's a good point, pasta. That's a very good point. Plus, plus, honey glazed anything's fucking tasty. I know me foods, kinda. Yeah? Nope. Oh, wrong stance. What better friend to have than a ramen chef, right? Uh oh. Didn't know I could do that. Because now it's one on one, I can kick your ass like this. Beautiful. This point shop is shit, bro. Yeah, how so? With the, uh, on the stream avatars. It's so long, but I have to give value to each item just so people have their use for coins. That, that's, it does sound tedious. What, what, uh, what can you spend the coins on? Uh, like, for, uh, gear and stuff? I gotta... <laughs> I like co uh, avatars and cosmetics. Color swaps as well. Huh. Interesting. So, like, you can... Uh, there are, like, premium, air quotes, um, avatars. That's interesting. I like that there's a key mini game that you have to... You have to be able to organize and know what key you need for what door. So I have to give a price for every Pokemon in the set, Terraria, Armor, and Weapons? Ouch. Music that soothes the soul. Every good, de every good detective has a vintage record player in the office, so put a record on and jam out to your favorite tunes. The music will keep playing as long as you stay inside the office. You can find new records all throughout uh, Camarocho. Cool. Standard Terrarium, uh, let's see. So I have a standard Terrarium model and um, uh, an Amogus are free, but the gear will be coined. Ah, I see. So are you switching from the Pokemon to Terraria models, or are you going to have the Pokemon and the Terraria people? I guess I should get some records first. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You've got Pokemon based uh Pokemon based on the stage will cost either 250, 500, or 1k. I just want to give them coins, proper value. Ah, uh, alright. 
So, uh... Right on. So the, uh, the, the... The Terraria, the Terraria, pe the Terraria dudes will be, um, uh... Will be, like, the base thing, and then you have to win coins to, uh... To, uh... Get more, uh, to pick something else, is that... That one I'm understanding? Hmm. Man, there are so many people you can make friends with in this game. It's wild. Terraria and Moga's malls are free. Alright, alright. Oh, that's right. Yeah. And the recolors of both are free. Okay, right on. Right on. Oh, Club Sega. Look at this. Since this is a Sega game, they just have, like, straight-up ports of arcade games in their game. <laughs> I don't know what some of these are. I'm not familiar with any of these ones. Let's see. Fighting Vipers is 100 yen uh, per play. Should I play? Sure, why the hell not? Alright. Work can wait. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Hey, look, it's Jotaro. Let's see. Who do I want to be? Let's be Jotaro. Oh. It is just, it literally is Jotaro. What the fuck? Look at him. He's got the hair and everything. Ah, I see. Oh no. Uh, okay. Ah, boy. I can't... <laughs> Straight up just Jotaro. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what is this game? Uh... Ah, blasted. This is a very clunky fighter. Doesn't help that it didn't tell me what buttons do what. Damn. I don't know how to do any fancy combos or shit. <laughs> Oh damn. It's kicking my ass. I'm kicking my ass? Question mark. I don't know why I'm fighting. Okay. Alright. Well, there's that. Page four out of eight on characters. Oof. Ouch. No, I didn't want to play. Shit, I wanted to exit. I, wa I wanted to exit. Okay, whatever. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, I'm so getting my ass kicked. There we go. That's something. Dick. Wow. This, uh... Makes sense why I've never heard of this game. Because, uh, um... <laughs> it's rough. 
I'm pretty sure all of the game, all of the games in this, all the arcade games are actual arcade games too. Like they're all. What? Whoa, 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 whoa! There's like locational damage and stuff. What? What? What the fuck? No! I did it again! Oh shit! I wanted to get out! Quit! Yes! Yes! Okay, there we go. Reminds me of Virtual Fighter. Uh, well, I think Virtual Fighter, I think that's at that right here. <laughs> Virtual Fighter is, uh, yeah. Virtua Fighter <laughs> Fighter is right over here. Um, cause it, it it's a Sega game. They're both it, they're both Sega fighting games. Yeah. So we'll we'll try that. I appreciate that they're just fucking ports of whole ass games in here. Cool. Oh. Obviously, I have to be the. I gotta be the. Yeah. I gotta be the luchador. I love me some luchadors, man. Fucking favorite. Favorite style of wrestling is uh, the high fly and luchadors, you know. Jeez. Oh yeah, this feels so much better than. Uh... Oh yeah. That's how you do it. That feels good. Much more satisfying fighting game the other one than the other one. Whoa! I don't know how I did that. I'm just button mashing, really. Oh yeah! I love that flying press. Oh yeah! Satisfying. <sighs> I assume you're ready. Round one. Ready, go. And straight to the press. <laughs> oh, this is too easy. What? So any any that's my that's my entire jump attack. That's <laughs> that's a little OP, not gonna lie. Yeah. I'm fighting myself. Cool. Come on. What a cocky prick wearing his... Wearing that... Wearing his, uh... Fucking... Jacket in here. Come on. There we go. 
This difficulty is far too low. I'm barely even trying. The funny thing is that the last game I played of the series was 4 on PS2. <laughs> <laughs> that is <laughs> nice. I've uh, the only virtual fighter I've played was I think I don't know whatever the I guess it's the newest one that was added to um I had the PlayStation Now and I downloaded it and tried it a little bit but it's uh I never played it very much because I'm not I'm not super good at um fighting games, and it's a lot harder than this one, this version. Oh, shit. I spoke too soon about this being easy. Alright. I guess this is the P. This must be uh, the PS3 edition, or the one that came out on the PS3, because this feels like PS3 graphics. You know. Oh shit. Or that era of graphics. Oh. I know that. I've seen that move set before. If I'm playing a fighting game in, our, in an arcade, it's pro it's usually Street Fighter or um, uh, Street Fighter or Tekken. <clears throat> Mostly because those are the only ones that I'm like really familiar with the character. Oh, or Mortal Kombat, but I don't I don't usually play the older Mortal Mortal Kombat. They're not really my speed, you know. Okay, enough of that. Yeah. Alright. I think we wasted enough time. I can go. I can go continue on with the story. Maybe. I think I've spent enough at the arcade. I don't have a lot of money. As is. Alright. Let's go uh, see if we can find out some something about somebody's alibi. Let's go do some detective work. Oh, punks, go away. Another Club Sega? I wonder if they have different games here. Let's see. I know I said I was done with the arcade, but I'm not done with the arcade. Kamura! <laughs> oh! It's, it's fucking Kamura of the Dead. It's fucking House of the Dead. Alright. Oh, and Crane Game. Let's see. Oh, there's an upstairs. Let's see what's upstairs. I'll, uh, I'll play one game of the, uh, of the, um, what's this? Huh, I don't know what that is. Racing game. Neat. Uh, oh, is this darts? Is that what that is? Yeah, darts. I'll, uh, I'll go show you some House of the Dead or House of the Dead ripoff. I'm not sure. Um,. Wow, should I, uh, <laughs> Camera of the Dead is 500 yen per play? Wow, should I though? Yes. Alright, work can wait. A man is on trial for fucking, is, is, is gonna be on trial for fucking murder. But, uh, I got time for some, uh, arcade games. Alright. I don't know how this is gonna work with the uh, with the controller. It's gonna be weird.
Kick, 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 yeah. Uh <laughs> So this is a this is a House of the Dead made specifically for this game. Oh my god. That's fucking great. <laughs> Page six, let's go. Good luck, pal. Oh, that's that's fucking cool. It's a uh, ah ah ah. Okay, I see. Go away. Nah, go away. Shoot. Fuck off. Ah, no. This isn't this isn't the best representation of uh, House of the Dead because this this seems pretty. Um... It's not as in depth as uh, the original House of the Dead, the actual House of the Dead games. Oh shit. Also, you don't have the the witty characters. Yeah. Which are part of the real draw of the House of the Dead or the uh is this campy over the topness of it. Oh shit, 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 fuck. Come on, there we go. Screw you. Ass. No, 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 oh, piss. I'm doing way better at this than I do with the uh, real House of the Dead games. Mostly because I'm not using a light gun. I'm pretty terrible at the with the light gun shit. This is a very simple version of it. A L lot less stressful. But I appreciated its existence nonetheless. Fuck you. Yeah. Yeah! Want the big guy first. There we go. Oh, back off. Back off. Back off. Back off. Beautiful. Oh! Oh! Sprinting zombies! I will not have any of it. Uh oh, flying zombie. I guess the House of the Dead, they're, they're not zombies, they're mutants. Oh, fuck you! Fuck you! Oh, bastard. Oh, boy. Another one of these assholes, eh? Grenade! I'm mostly bad at these games because I'm bad at reloading in time. And uh, when it forces you to reload, you uh, reload real slow. Oof. Ah! Oh, damn. Yeah. Yeah, this is a very, very simple rendition of the... Aw, D. D. Piss.
<laughs> uh, is it bad my hate for Garchomp made me put him in it, uh, put him in bits? Um, uh, bits is in. You have to actually pay. Oh no, I died. Shit. As in, you have to pay like bits for it. Um, or did you turn him into like bits of Garchomp? Cause I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I, uh, I've got no, uh, yeah, I really don't like the fucker. <laughs> I, Garchomp, hold on, I need to, I need to look that up so I know which one, it, what it looks like. I know the name, I just can't. Oh, Garchomp, right, okay. Yeah? <laughs> so you can, uh, I don't really ever want to see it. Why don't you like Garchomp? Yeah, what, 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 what's wrong with the, the walking hammerhead? The land shark. Okay, I can't. Is that Super Monkey Ball? It's the Super Monkey Ball monkeys! <laughs> I'm not playing this, but... <laughs> it's the Super Monkey Ball monkeys. That's fun. I'm gonna come back for them. Fanboys and Dragon Bummers, sadly. Ah. Uh, yeah. I mean, not gonna lie, I'm a bit of a scaly myself, but yeah, I can understand. Plus, it's typing annoys me a, a shark ain't draconic. That's true. That's very true. Yeah, I can understand. Yeah, that's fair. I don't remember where I'm going. I don't even know where I'm going. I didn't, uh, I didn't know Garchomp had a particularly large fan base. Oh, I'm in the wrong, I'm in the wrong, uh, stance for this. Or style. Hey. Hey now. Okay, fine, fuck it. Yeah. Hmm. By design, as it's mimic Gen 3 Shark, um, I feel it should be ground dark similar to Crocodile. Well, um, I guess. Um, or water dark, you know, since it's a fucking shark. But I guess it's, since it's a land shark. Yeah, that's a fair, that's fair, yeah, makes sense. There's bowling, I, I gotta not, I don't have the yen for any more, more activities. I gotta, I gotta fucking. Really? Whoa, hey, hey now, I didn't want to fight. I didn't want to fight. Fuck off. Wrong fucking... Okay, there we go. Yeah. In, uh... <laughs> I actually think you might really enjoy, um... The Yakuza series a lot, uh... Pasta. Water Dark is a Fen 3 typing for 3 Shark. Yeah, uh, for their Shark. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Um, I don't know. I'm not really a big Pokemon person, so I don't have a, like a ton of skin in the game, or uh, you know, I don't have enough knowledge to make a informed, um, hey, you find informed uh, opinion. Over at the Kyore hideout, a place called KJ Art. And you made it out of there in one piece. Incredible. All in a day's work, Shintani Sensei. Yeah, but I think I think you'd really enjoy the Yakuza series. Pasta. Midnight on the third. That directly contradicts the prosecution's assertion that Hamura was beating Kume to death at the time. Well, the 
that's a hell of a find. But is Marase going to testify? It's not that easy. Never is. Either way, Marase is telling the truth. I found something that backs his story up. Hmm? Oh. This is a more. Three hours after Hamura took Kume. Midnight. Take a good look at the edge of the screen. Where? We don't see any of them go inside, so I thought nothing of it. Hmm. But the stories match up. Murase and his guys went to a moor to take Kume back. And they left empty-handed. So I saw the camera and then headed to the back door. Interesting. Uh, sounds like we need to talk to Captain Hamra. There are too many unanswered questions. Agreed. I'll set up another visit. Give me a call once you do. Sorry for the rant, it's just some people I dealt with in the past put me uh, in a fury against most dragons. Well, I mean, it is what it is. I, don't worry about it, man. Like, rant all you want as long as you're ranting, not ranting about uh, huh? shitty shit, you know? Yeah. Why do you ask? She seemed happy. It had been a while since she last saw you. Oh, cool. Mm -hmm. She looks sad, too. Sad? I wonder why. As do I. See you later. Can I talk to you? I want to talk to... Well, I want to talk to the kid. Can I talk to the old man? Can't talk to the old man. Okay. <laughs> I should deal with it personally. <sighs> yeah. Fair enough. Um, but yeah, I was, I was saying, I think you might really enjoy these games, Pasta, especially, uh, Yakuza 0. The, the, the side quests in that game are fucking wild, and the characters, the, the main characters are phenomenal. Like, it's, uh, this series is very much like playing, uh, playing an anime game, or an anime, an a playing an anime, but with, uh, without the anime style, you know? It's a very off the wall like larger than life kind of kind of um kind of game I do love some Sega games might be worth a go yeah yeah um I'd either start with uh this game Judgment or Yakuza 0 probably um, I, I haven't played any of, any of the other Yakuza games. I've just seen them played. I've seen Zero played, and then I've played a little bit of Four, but not, not, never got, I didn't get very far. Um, because I had to stream the game, like, like, not play the game on stream, but I had to, like, stream the game through a game streaming service, right? And it, uh, it's just not, streaming the game is just not something that's worthwhile. Um, but, yeah. Uh, hmm. I guess we, uh, fuck around and, um, I guess we can play some more mini games Or kick these guys' ass, that works too. Uh, the, but Yakuza 0 is a, is a prequel to the series the Yakuza series and uh, takes place in the 80s and uh, there's <laughs> there's um really, guys? you play as a uh, you go between two different characters uh, Kiryu and um, Majima I think you'd really enjoy the both of them I think you'd really like Majima a lot he's um He's great. He's, uh... You meet him... When you first meet him, he's a very cordial, level-headed guy. But, uh... Once he gets, uh... But, uh... Once you get to know him a little bit, he's a, a fucking hot-headed, fight-loving... He's good. He's great. He's fucking amazing. Probably my favorite character in the series. As far as I've experienced. Will do. Thanks. 
but yeah, I think you would. I think you'd really enjoy these, and you should give them a chance if you, if you gotta. Am I supposed to take a cab? Yes, I'm supposed to take a cab. What? Um. Yeah. Going to the police station. Talking to some pigs. Not talking to some pigs. Good question. Don't ask me. Shintani senses your lawyer, remember? Hammer-san. I've got something to show you. December 3rd. 11.55 p.m. A curie man by the name of Murase comes to a moor to rescue Kume. Not wanting to be seen by the cameras, he goes in through the back. And I have 29 pages of recolors. Fuck, dude. Shit. Good luck. <laughs> what did you do with Kume? I already told you I threw him out the back. And before that? Huh? Around 10 o'clock, you kicked him uh, out of the house. Uh, by. I have testimony to back that up. Why'd you do it, though? What can I say? I guess Kume reminded me of an old friend. I must have been feeling nostalgic. Who knows, though? That was pretty plastic. He was suddenly, uh, he's suddenly getting evasive. He even pulled the I was too drunk to remember card. That's so. Did you need to kick everyone out just for that? I told you I was drunk. Who knows what I was thinking? Well, you seem to remember other parts clearly, though. Like when you left the club. What are you getting at? For a so-called innocent man with an alibi, your story has an awful lot of holes. Oh, yeah? You wouldn't hide something from us, would you? Of course not. Something like the true killer's identity? I said I'm not hiding shit! Now get the hell out there and prove my alibi. I was at the sauna all night long. Prove that and I'm in the clear. Hmm. I need to have a backup plan in case your alibi doesn't pan out. But I can't help you if you're going to hide things from your lawyer. You're suspected of abducting a rival clan member, gouging his eyes out and dumping him in an alleyway. They'll lock you up and toss the key if we can't win this. Has that thought even crossed your mind? Or are all yakuza are just that fearless in the face of a life sentence? Fear has nothing to do with it. But like hell, I'm gonna beg you to save me. Then who would you beg? <laughs> None of your business. It's only a matter of time, Hamra. I'll figure out what you're hiding. Hey, Yagami. Uh, by the by, I've been listening regarding Yakuza. I'll take a ponder about it. Right on, right on. Like, uh, it's not something I, uh, I'm saying you should, like, uh, like, go out right away and buy it, but, like, if you get a chance to play it, you should, I think it's something you might enjoy. Um, lucky for me. Oh shit! Hold on. He's keeping something from us. There might be more to this case than we thought. So what? You telling me we hit a dead end? More or less. I need more to work with. Specifically, like what Hamura and Kume did after leaving Amor. Eyewitness testimony. We don't have time to scour the city for leads, though. Hey, how much money you got? How much you need? You only need 30k or so. I've got this friend, a local detective on the force. He'll tell you anything for the right price. Anything? Anything. The guy's an informant. You want the dirt only cops have access to. He's the guy you hit up. So you're saying he's a dirty cop? 
And uh, that's next Yakuza for you. Underground police info sounds useful. Name's Ayabe. He's a regular over at Tender. Really? Yeah. Surprised you'd never run into him, man. It's where everyone goes to meet him. Try asking huh. your pal Masa. Hmm. Sorry, I, I, I'm, uh, sorry I keep, uh, dropping off when, uh, while I'm, uh, trying to talk to y'all. I, um, I want to focus on the story as much as possible. And, uh, don't want to miss it. Because I'm actually, actually interested in what's going on. Um, let's see, lucky for me, recolors will all be 50 coins, so it'll be easier to rush. Right on, right on. But still, that's a, that's a lot of shit to do. Alright. There's so much to do in this game, it's real easy to burn through time. And it's an interesting story, so like the, the the time flies by, you know. Cause sometimes when I when you're when I'm streaming, you know, shit just like fucking drags. I don't have the money for this. I do not have the money to. Uh, how do I make more money? I don't have money. Hmm. Let's see. Valuables. No. Oh, I can set. Oh, hello. I can set um, shortcuts. Interesting. Mm hmm. Yeah, that should be good. Um, I don't have any cash. Don't really have anything to sell to get cash. Um, maybe I go around uh, looking for Punkster Mug? Oh well. Forget it. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna go for it. You, uh, you gonna be streaming tonight, Pasta? Or today? Hey, you have a sec? Of course. What do you need? I'm looking for a detective. Ayabe. You know him? Sure do. He hasn't been by in a few days, though. Why? Hmm. Uh, damn. Guess I came at the wrong time. I'll have to come back later. Sure hope this guy is worth the trouble. It's okay. I'll let him know you were looking for him. Why don't you have a drink or two in the meantime? First one's on me. What's all this? <laughs> Just buttering you up. Remember when I mentioned someone who had a job for you? Oh, yeah. What of it? Well, turns out they won't have one for you after all. Sorry. Apparently, the client was trying to get back at some Yakuza who sucker punched him. And he wanted me to do what? Not sure. Doesn't matter now, anyway. Why, did he go all vigilante on him? Not exactly. It sounds like the Yakuza ended up behind bars. Hmm. Killing a man. And oh, shit. Eyes huh? Wait a second. Captain Homura. Surprised? Though, now that you mention it, I remember something about a host getting smacked in the face that night. By a Yakuza? Yep. Don't think he got hurt too bad, though. Pretty sure it happened right around midnight. Oh, fuck yeah. The lead I need. Anything else you can tell me? Sorry, but that's all I've got. We'll have to ask the guy directly. If the Yakuza who punched the host by the sauna was Hamura, then that might help establish his alibi that he went into the sauna go uh, that he went into sauna Goten afterwards. I should ask the host. Who is he? 
man by the name of Seiya. He's a host over at Club Stardust on Tenkaichi Street. That's what I'd like. Yeah, probs in an hour or two. Kind of want to get the shop sword and test it. Right on, right on. I, uh, probably won't be playing uh, long enough to, um, raid you, but, uh, at the moment, um, it'd be kind of pointless, because seeing as you're, uh, looks like you're the only person here right now, so. <laughs> Raiding you into your own stream seems like a little bit of a... Silly thing to do. That's a big traffic cone. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> are these legit? Are these legit traffic cones or or fucking art installations? <laughs> what? <laughs> Do these exist? I've never seen a traffic cone this big. <laughs> to why? <wind. laughs> <laughs> Sega large, Sega large cones. <laughs> Why do I find that so funny? <laughs> oh, why does that make me laugh so hard? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I want a man-sized traffic cone. <laughs> you have a sec? What do you need? I'm looking for someone who works here. Can I talk to Seiya for a sec? Seiya, son, huh? No can do. Not today. Is he off today? Not quite. He's out on a date with a customer. Damn, I could be practically anywhere then. Hmm. Day in a row, too. He's got it wrapped around his finger. Yeah, that's great. Any idea when he'll be back? No clue. I doubt he went far, but that's all I've got. All right, cool. Thanks anyway. First the owner of more, now this guy? Why can't people just be at their clubs? Wait, maybe I can find him the same way, I, uh, same way as before. It's worth a shot. Yo, Tsukumo. Oh, hey, Yanamishi. What's up? I, uh, I need something. Think you can do another message search for me? Sure. Just hit me with the keywords you need. Hmm. Let's go with Stardust and Seiya. Oh, and let's limit the search history to just today. You got it. Give me just a second here. It's working. It's working. Yeah, I'll just push this to your screen. Uh, no. Hmm. Uh, hmm. Hmm. Uh, food, date, play. Food. No. Nope. Yeah. Oh, damn. Play. Nope. Really? I guess date is the. Great. Should be easy to check these out myself. Thanks, Sukumo. Looks like he was. He's a. Uh, it's like he had three people on the line there. Interesting. I only read the the first and second one, but it looked like they were both invited out on a date. Oh, more assholes! I'm gonna steal your money. I'm gonna mug you fuckers. That's what you get for jumping me, for absolutely no reason. 
Where's the other one? There's... Oh, the other two. Where are they? Come on. Yeah. <coughs> cool. Yeah. Oh, I didn't get any money from them. Shit. That sucks. Yeah, losers, get out of the way. Oh, oh, there are three spots I have to check out. Okay, I see what why there are three things on the... Okay. Excuse me, ma'am. What is it? I'm looking for a host named Seiya. Works at the <coughs> coast. Wait, you know Seiya-kun? Is he alright? We were gonna go on a date tonight, but he never showed. Mm. I'm kinda worried. Huh? I'd heard he was on a date around here too, but I guess that means it wasn't with you. Uh oh. Uh, better luck next time? Wait, what? Seiya-kun's out with another girl? Sounds like it, but... Don't take it too hard. I'm sure you'll bounce back. Oh, thank goodness he's safe. I thought he'd gotten into an accident or something. I wonder if he's having fun on his date. As long as he's happy, I'm happy. Doesn't look like Say is here. I'll try somewhere else. Well, that's not the reaction I, I expected, but, um... That seems like a pretty, uh... Pretty healthy reaction. Maybe. Nope, can't get out this way. I was hoping I could cut through this mall, but it does not look like it. Maybe I can. Wait, yeah, here we go. <coughs> here we go. Perfect, yeah. Sorry. Sorry. That group J was told us to, uh nope. I don't see anybody here. Oh, they look like they're on a date. Oh nope. This must be who I'm supposed to talk Excuse to. Me, man. What? I'm looking for a host named Saya. Works at Stardust. Huh? What do you want with Saya? <coughs> I need to ask him something. I heard he was on a date around here. Did you say date? Who's the bitch he's cheating on me with? Oh, Jet. you know what? Never mind. It's fine. <laughs> it's not fine. What the hell is going on? That's the reaction oh, I expected. Uh, look at the time. Gotta run. <laughs> Doesn't look like Say is here. Man, this guy is, uh... This guy seems like an ass. Juggling women. <coughs> Shit. Are they in Don Quixote? No, probably not. Most definitely not. Oh. Hmm. Wait a sec. You mean Saya, that host from Stardust? Hmm. Who are you? Are you from the club? Uh, no, sorry. I'm just looking for Saya. I'd ask where he is, but it looks like you know as much as I do. Uh-oh. Hey, are you implying my Seiya Kun stood me up? I'm sure he's just taking his time <clears throat> getting ready. He'll be here any minute. Uh-huh. Uh, 
How long have you been waiting anyway? No. I... I... <laughs> I shouldn't have asked. Excuse me. <laughs> Shit. I did not. No, nope. struck out on all three leads. Huh. How about giving it another try? Nah, I'm good. I'll figure out some other way. Don't be such a sour puss, Yagamishi. I bet there have been more posts since earlier. Doubt that's gonna change much. But sure, why not? Let's see what you got. <laughs> Let's start with the same keywords from before. Is that a new hit? The landscape of social media changes every second. Apparently, they posted it only a minute ago. <laughs> That's not a hot lead. I don't know what is. Oh, Shit. Right, I'll check it out. Thanks for everything, Tsukumo. <laughs> not a problem. <laughs> Man, this guy is a gigantic douchebag. Fucking. I'm a gigantic douchebag that can't fucking plan shit, apparently. Making a bunch of plans with a bunch of different women on the same. for the same day, same time, just to leave them all hanging. He's gonna get his ass beat. <clears throat> Not by me. I think the, uh... I think that last lady and the, the second lady I talked to were, uh... gonna team up and kick the crap out of him. Maybe... knock him down? Yeah. If I get the chance, I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. Don't you, uh... Don't you worry, but um, I think those uh, those two ladies might get to him first. Ugh! Being chased by some punks for absolutely no reason. I don't know what their shit is. I don't know why street punks just feel the need to kick your ass whenever you walk by. And just gonna stroll right into this fancy restaurant. No reservations. <coughs> I'm definitely gonna ruin this fucking date if all possible. Hoi hoi hoi. Yeah. Huh? Sorry to butt in. You have a sec? You'll have to excuse me, my child. I won't be. Hey. Okay? He's a real pretty boy. Don't worry. Well, I'll be I see why everyone is uh, horning for him. Wait, you know who I am? What? I do. Why? Oh, right, cause he uh he wanted to hire me. That's right. That's right. That's why he knows who I am. That makes never mind. Tender told me about you. Thought I'd ask you to do me a favor. You want to get back at a yakuza who hit you, man? Yes. I said you might be able to manage something. A disgraced ex-lawyer who's not afraid to get his hands a little dirt. Sounds like you're pretty well known in Kamara, John. So that's what people say about me? One more thing. This is just a rumor, but I hear you'll do anything for your clients. You even got a murderer off the hook, right? Hmm. Oh, did I... Say something wrong? No, it's all right. Anyway, you said Captain Hamra hit you. <clears throat> That's right. When? The night of December third. You probably deserve it. Murder. You're sure? Yes. Funny enough, I've been hired to look into Hamra's case. This story of yours could be key evidence. That's so. Not sure I want to be the guy who sets him free. I know you two have a history, but I need this. Please. How could I say no to a celebrity like you? It's fine. He's so hot, I almost don't... <clears throat> I almost don't want to beat him up anymore. Yes, I might be able to prove Hamura's alibi now. What time did you run into Hamura? Uh, congratulations on being the done with the point shot, Pasta. Not the busiest place. Kyushu number one star. Isn't that near Sonic 10? Yeah, it is. Mind telling me more? 
Why'd he hit you in the first place? <laughs> Wish I knew. The guy reeked of booze, though. I was just walking down the street when I noticed him coming towards me. He was like mumbling to himself or something. Kind of scary shit. I tried to avoid him. He just barreled towards me anyway. And how many times did he hit you? Just the once. He left a fucking nasty bruise though. Knocked one of my fillings clean out too. Oof. Filling, huh? Did you go to the dentist? Huh? Yeah, next day. Then you'll be in their records. That'll corroborate your testimony. Ah, so that's what you were getting at. Moving on. What did Hamura do after he hit you? He stumbled away into a sauna. That Goten place he mentioned. So just to recap, he hit you around 12 and then headed into sauna Goten. Yes. That old guy at the sauna said that no one left the place until morning. And as long as I can prove Hummer was here, we'll have our alibi. Oh yeah, the cops mentioned something kind of similar. Can I count on your testimony in court? No problem. It'd be nice to have the great Yagami-san owe me a favor. Maybe Masada could give me a few freebies too. <laughs> sure, I'll ask him. Hey, one more thing. Did you see any security cameras around when you ran into Hamura? Video evidence would lock this up for me. Hmm. Couldn't say. I don't usually look for that stuff. Right. Well, thanks anyway. I'll be in touch. Of course. See ya. Man, I'm a sucker for Houndstooth. I like it. I fucking... <clears throat> that guy's got style. So I went down in front of Kyushu number one star. That's the best lead I've got right now. Let's hope they have a camera. <clears throat> right on. Man, I really wanted to punch that guy until I met him. And then, like, he was just too cool and hot. And, you know, like, fuck. I stopped, I immediately stopped wanting to punch him. I thought, <laughs> fuck. I understand why he's so popular now. Negative. But I did track down someone who had a run with Hamra. Yeah? Is it good news? His alibi might be more airtight than you thought. You're kidding. Just around midnight on the day of the crime, this guy Seiya got hit by Hamra, then saw him go to the sauna. It was apparently right by Kyushu number one star. If they have a security camera, it would have caught everything. I'm heading to check it out now. Hold on. Isn't that near KJR? Those Kyuro guys won't be happy to see you. If I was worried about getting seen, I'd never leave the office. Huh. Fair enough. Later. I I really wanna know <clears throat> really wanna know why uh why Yagami can um infiltrate a fucking Yakuza hideout, then kick a bunch of Yakuza in Yakuza's ass and then fucking get out unscathed. I, like, why is this, why is he that fucking, why is he that fucking good at fighting? How is he that skilled and strong? I do not understand. <clears throat> I mean, it probably has something to do with being raised by a, a, a a fucking head of Yakuza family, I guess. I think he was raised by him. Or he's he's, he's like a father, fi father figure to him. This is where Say I got hit. A security camera would have caught something. Let's see. Mm-hmm. I'm looking. A security camera. So if there is a camera, let's hope Hamura is on there. All right. Hey, you. Oh, well, shit. I know you, boy. Marase. What a coincidence. Shit. <laughs> That's a lot of Yakuza. Clear your <clears throat> I'm gonna take my time with you. Boys. 
All right. Get this fucker back to the office. I really don't have time for this. You talk. Yeah. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Fuck yeah, Kaido! That was pretty sweet, man. Hey, you want to try helping out? Sure thing. Oh yeah! I'm looking forward to this. Uh oh. Just pulling the katana right in the middle of the street. No. Oh. oh. Oh shit. Give me your shit. Drop that so I can pick it up, please. I don't think I can pick it up. Fuck you guys. Man. Didn't you get enough the last time? Oh, wait, 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 come on, come on. Yes. Oh, so cool. Oh, so cool. Oh, yeah. Shit. That was it. It's regrettable. Oof. Whew. Nope. Damn. Fucking intense, intense cinematics. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, I see what the mortal mortal wounds do. Kick his ass with a cardboard box. Ah, come on. Ooh. Ouch. Come on. Fuck off. Let me grab you. Dick. Oh, I'm so gonna die here. Oh boy. Well. No, oh, come on. Leave Kaido alone. Leave my friend alone. Fuck you. Come on. Oh boy. He's really kicking my ass. Woo! Satisfying. Please tell me you found something. You did, right? I think I did. Check out that camera. We're in the clear if the thing puts Hamura here at midnight. And if it doesn't? Let's... Let's try and stay optimistic. Let's hope they still have the fucking well, recordings. Camera. You got good news for us or what?
This video shows everything you need to see. My client, Hammerson, drunkenly attacked this passerby on the night of the murder. Then, after the altercation, that same passerby watched Hammerson walk into Sana Goten. Nobody came out of the building after that, until the train started in the morning, meaning the defendant was accounted for during the hours in question. The defense asserts that this video establishes a clear alibi, which can only be seen as proof of Hamarasan's innocence. To that end, I have a question for the prosecution. Did you have any prior knowledge of this video before the trial began? I assure you that we reviewed all the relevant footage from the sauna. And yet the defendant was nowhere to be found, counsel. At least so I was told. Meaning, you never actually went to examine the site personally then. Would you say that's correct? Yes. My associates took care of that. Nonetheless, the defense's video is far too blurry to clearly identify either participant. There's no way to tell whether the man in the footage was the defendant or just a random pedestrian. Thank you very much. In that case, the defense would like to call a witness to the stand. Oh boy, don't fuck us over. Come on, pretty boy. Why is he always so fly? Uh oh. This doesn't sound this doesn't this doesn't feel good. Say so. Do you claim you're the person in this video? That someone assaulted you that night. Is that accurate? Yes. It is. Now tell us. This person who assaulted you, are they here? in the courtroom. Uh-oh. Is there a problem? I am. Um, I must have... Oh no. Son of a bitch, somebody got to him! Son of a bitch! Son of a bitch! Your Honor, a recess, if you don't mind. Now I want to go back to punching him. Though it looks like uh, he's under duress, so I don't know. What happened in there? I, I, I can't do it. I'm so sorry. But why? You were all ready to go this morning. I got a phone call earlier. Go on. It said it was from my sister, but there was a strange man on the line. He said his name was Morase. Told me you know him, Yagami son. Morase. Motherfucker. Did you not to testify? Yes. He said if I did. If I did, I'd never see my sister again. Shit. What are you doing, Yagami? Calling the police? Kaito-san, it's me. Those KJ art guys took Seiya's sister. I'm heading over there now. Use a hand. Oh, hell yeah. What the hell are you doing? We're in the middle of a trial here. You're in the middle of a trial. trial. doesn't mean shit if you can't protect your witness. Um. <sighs> Buy me as much time as you can. I'll get to say a sister back. I'm the one who dragged you into this. I'll be the one to drag you out. I promise. Mm. By time, he says. He knows this is a court, right?
Damn, yeah. Fucking... Yeah. Heavy ass shit, man. Just fucking wrecking everything as I go. Oh, good thing we're right here. Cool. Thanks. I'm itching my face with my knee. Ah. Yo, Skyjo, I'm here. Where are you? I'm right around the corner. Place looks kind of deserted. Lines down and everything. Are we sure this is where they got her? No. From Kansai, remember? They can't have that many hideouts. Plus... Plus what? I bet there's a reason all the blinds are down. If anything, that makes it more suspicious. I guess you've got a point. Anyways, I'll be up on the roof again. See you soon. That roof? Or the other roof? This roof, yes. Go straight up ladder. This roof is seeing a lot of action. Still can't get eyes on what's in there. Got any bright ideas? Well, we can't just barge in. Who knows how many of them are in there? No way I'm getting away with a disguise now, either. Then, I guess we gotta sneak in. That's the only way. <laughs> I had a feeling. I've got a plan. Yeah? Lay it on me. First, I'll make a big scene out front. Then when they're distracted, you sneak in and get the girl. That's your big plan? Pretty good, huh? <laughs> sure. How are you gonna do it? You'll see soon enough. Just remember, both our asses are on the line here. I won't forget. So, the girl's in there, yeah? Let's go bring her home. Right. Hell yeah. I'll go look for a way in. Let you know when I find one. Well, that's one way to make some noise. What the fuck? Hey, where's that asshole Morase? Name's Kaito, ex Matsugane. Bring him out, or I'll burn this shit down. <laughs> oh, fuck. I dare you. Just stay right there, punk. <laughs> oh, my God, I love him. Man looks like Oryx from. Not, I'm not familiar with the character. Gotta pick the lock again. Stupid thing. Shit. I suck at this. Stop. Siege. Uh, yeah, I've never played. Uh, nice. Never played Siege. Almost there. There we go. Perfect. Boy, howdy. Really wish I was that. I was that. Uh, it's locked, but I should be able to open it with a simple thumb turn bypass. Work those thumbs. Using a thumb turn bypass is yet another way to open a locked door. Slip a thin wire through the door's gap and turn the knob on the other side of the door uh, to unlock it. If you don't have a thin wire, you won't be able to use a thumb turn bypass. Oh.
Ow, ow, ow. Okay. Shit. Oh, I suck at this. Shit. Oh, okay. Why am I better? Oh, I suck at this. Shit. I, I don't get it. Okay, hold on. Use to... F I see. Oh, okay, I get it, 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 I get it. Almost there. Shit. Oh, son of a bitch. Bah, the wire broke. Won't be able to use that one anymore. Well. That's fine. Just gonna ignore the lady. Huh? <laughs> the tooth motherfucker! Just carrying a box of weapons. <laughs> Damn. I lo I want I want the Tonfa. Come on, lock on. <laughs> Four. Shit. Dude hits hard. More shit to pick up. Come on, pick up a sword. Pick up one. Pick up the sword. I want to duel you. Come on. Get up! Get up, Yagami! Ah! Come here! Oh! You! Where's the girl you took? I don't know nothing, honest. I'm new here. They don't tell me shit. Huh? Well, you're useless to me. Oh! <laughs> what fucking style! Oh my god, that was gorgeous. The casual fucking face kick. More lock picking. Yeah. Almost there. Shit. Ah, oh, shit. Nice. You ever try your hand at lock picking pasta? Like IRL?
Whoa. You're done for, bitch. Uh oh. Ah. Uh oh. Not what I, not exactly what I wanted, but. Shit, 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 shit. I want, I want, I want, I want this one. There we go. I know I can slide. Ho! Oh. Fuck yeah! Oh, that's satisfying. Come on, assholes. Ah! Ooh, fuck. Ooh, yeah. Oh, no, he's not dead. Shit. Oh, holy crap, I broke his sword. Can't say I have, to be honest. It's, uh... It's, uh, not as easy as, uh, games make it out to be, for sure. But, um... It's an interesting thing to try and do. Like, uh, fascinating thing to learn. Very actual, it's actually pretty, uh, pretty much this, except you can't see what you're doing. You have to do everything by feel. Um, but, uh, I was never able to, to get, to get each, to, to be able to pick the pens in the, individually. I only, I was only, I've only ever been able to, uh, Rake it, which is when you um, put tension on it, and then rake the. You, there's a, a special pick called a rake that you just pull through and hit the pins, and uh, hope to bump them into pump that bump them into place. And the uh, tension, you pushing the cylinder right, keeps the uh, pins from um, falling back down. Almost there. It's not an ideal way of picking a lock, and it only works for simple locks. Stupid thing. Shit. Come on. Almost there. Nice. There we go. Shit. Shit. Almost there. Almost there. Yeah, uh... It's definitely a, a kind of skill I want to... It's the, definitely a skill I want to, uh... Master. Righty, need to lurk. Gotta get some grubs. Right on. Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna be finishing up, uh... This... This, uh... Mission or whatever, and then I'll be, um... I'll be heading off, so... There we go. Really, guys? Not in here. Picking this lock into this room seemed uh, mighty unnecessary. 
Not a worries. Fight back before you have to end. Have a good one, matey. It's been a uh, been a pleasure. Yeah. You... Enjoy your food, pal. Thanks for coming. Tell me what I want to know, or else. Um. Where's the girl? She's up in the reception room. Got it. Appreciate the honesty. All right. Uh. Ooh, shit. What is the right answer? What's the code for the reception room? Like I tell you. <laughs> I don't have time for your. <laughs> Just fucking kicked him in the dick. Now I'm gonna ask you again. What's the code <laughs> to the reception room? <laughs> Straight up kicked him in the dick. Got it. Huh. Didn't think that key would come in handy a second time. Oh my god. Is there a lock I'm not gonna have to pick? One, three, seven, zero. All right. You're Saya's sister, right? Don't worry. You're safe now. The balls. When the Fuck. Did you get here? Let the girl go. Right now. What do you mean, let her go? The girl can leave whenever she wants. We don't have her tied up or nothing. I get it. It's all fine if you aren't keeping her captive, right? Just have to make her stay here until the trial's over. He really thought this one through. But that's not gonna work. Huh? Confinement is a crime whether or not your captive is tied up, you Shut your trap! You know, false imprisonment will get you between three months and seven years. Maybe even longer if you hurt the victim. Guess you'll have to take a little dip in an acid bath then. No body, no crime. <laughs> Intimidation too? Tack on another year. You piece of... Come on, let's make sure this asshole never talks again! Hold on. Give me a second, folks. Let me, uh... <laughs> we'll get to the ass kicking in a second. I just gotta... Just gotta... Uh, top up a bit. Alright. Now we can go back to kicking your asses. Shit. Fuck. I wish I didn't have to be focused on somebody to uh, dodge. Screw you. Big mouth.
Fuck off. Let me pick up that ashtray. I want to beat somebody's face with an ashtray. Come on. Oh boy. Looks like I'm going to need another fucking health. Fuck this. Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, now it's just you and me, boy. Bash your face in with an ashtray. Oh shit. You just hit through me? Why are you doing that? Oh! There we go. Have an ass whooping. Come on. Oh shit. Not so fast, Yagami. Arasasa. Hasn't this gone on long enough? You're only gonna make things worse for yourself. Amara has an alibi. Someone else clearly killed Kuma. There's no reason for you to keep Saya from testifying. But if Amara didn't murder Kume, who did? I'm not sure. Amara might have an idea. He must have been working with the real murderer. What? That's right. Several several facts point to Hamura's involvement. The night of the crime, Kume went into Amora and just disappeared, right? He didn't contact you. Nobody saw him. He didn't even show up on any security footage. The way I see it, Kume never left Amora. In other words... Hamra must have handed him over to the real murderer. While Hamra was at the sauna making an alibi for himself, someone else was murdering Kume and gouging his eyes out. It almost makes sense. If Hamra ends up behind bars, I'll never be able to prove that theory. So what? You want to let Hamra walk? Better that than threaten a girl to stop someone from testifying. Besides, I thought you were above shit like this. <laughs> All right, just get out of here. You got guts for a detective. <laughs> Thanks. Fucking badass. The rest is up to Shintani. Amara-san is the one punching me in this video. The same man standing here today. I remember now. There's no doubt in my mind. So, you retract your earlier statement? Yes. My apologies. Your Honor, clearly this witness has no credibility. How does the defense respond? I admit, the witness was shaken up before. But I believe that's a perfectly understandable response. This is his first time in court, after all. I have no doubts regarding his credibility. This Stardust establishment. It's a host club, yes? How long have you been employed there? About two years. For that short a time frame, you seem to have an awful lot of trouble with your customers. Huh? Not sure what you mean. 
Several of them have approached you in hopes of marriage, have they not? They come spending huge sums of cash, so you act like you're ready to seal the deal. You say whatever it takes to make them happy in the moment, but your story changes once things start to get real. Five women have filed reports with the Consumer Affairs Bureau, and those are just the ones who have stepped forward. Can we really trust the words of such a manipulative man? With these character traits in mind, I sincerely doubt the credibility of the witness's testimony. And if the witness is indeed lying, the defendant's alibi is invalid. That is all. How does the defense respond? I'd like to continue on the topic of credibility. Mind if I ask you a few questions, prosecutor? Go ahead. First, allow me to fast forward the security footage to just a few days after the crime. Oddly enough, we'll be looking at the exact day the prosecution filed their suit. Hmm. Uh-oh. <clears throat> Isn't that you, prosecutor? <laughs> uh, yes. And in this footage, you're reenacting the altercation that took place between the defendant and our witness. Oh, and shit. What? No. Well, that's strange. You stated earlier that you hadn't seen any footage from the camera near the sauna. But then, how would you be able to reenact things exactly as they went down? You also claimed you did not inspect the area yourself. But it seems that wasn't the truth. Why are you hiding the truth from us, prosecutor? You're wrong! As you can see, the original footage isn't exactly clear. I would understand if you would deny that the defendant was the man who punched our witness. But instead, you claimed you hadn't seen the footage at all. Uh-oh. If I had a guess, when you first saw the footage, you realized Hamra might have been the other man. At the very least, you couldn't rule out the possibility. So you lied, I would say. That, that's not true. Can we be sure that what you say is credible? You've already lied outright in a court of law. And unfortunately for you, there's only one person who thinks the defendant is guilty. And that's you, prosecutor. Fuck. The night Kume got murdered. Hummer was holed up in Sonic Go 10 till morning. The footage from the security camera, Hummer's alibi, Seiya's testimony, it all lined up. With a story that airtight, there's no chance he could have killed Kume. We find the defendant, Kyohei Hummer, innocent. Woo! I will now clarify the reasoning behind this decision. Defendant, please be seated. The judge was right. Hamura definitely didn't kill Kume. But he had to have been involved. Hmm. Meanwhile, the real killer is still out there, hiding in the shadows of Kamurocho. Murdering Yakuza, gouging their eyes out, retreating into his den. So, I've given him a name. The Mole. Hmm. A lawyer's job is done once he proves the defendant innocent. But me? I'm not a lawyer. Not anymore. Meaning my search for the truth only ends when I say it does. My office might be small, but that doesn't mean I don't have a reputation to uphold. In other words, I'll do whatever it takes to bring Hamura and the Mole down. She...
Yagami-san. Nice seeing you. Gorgeous day. Who the fuck's this? the detective business been treating you lately? Yeah, I knew you'd show up here, Hattori. Yeah, fucking intense. I'm not in the mood for your shit today. Yeah, but it's my journalistic duty to hear what you have to say. It's not personal, just trying to do my job, okay? Cool Hattori, huh? Seen what your so called job produces. A fraudulent lawyer lets a murderer walk. A helpless girl suffers the consequences. <laughs> you and I both know you're the only reason the girl died. You just had to go and set that killer free, didn't you? And the good people who raised her still suffer for it. You can't be coming back now. What would her poor family have to say to that? Huh? Yagami-san. No need to worry about that. If you say so. See you around, then. No one's ever gonna let him live that down. Yeah, I didn't eat. I decided to prep for Smite Sunday post parts. <laughs> Right on, well, I mean... Oh! <clears throat> okay. Well, uh, I'm glad you got to, uh, got to see that. Um... Oh! Previously, the year is 2018. Kamarocho is playing host to Kansai based Yakuza, who've been turning up dead with their eyes gouged out. Lawyer turned detective Takayuki Yagami took on the case, proving the suspect's alibi. But he can't shake the feeling that the true culprit is out there. He gives this anonymous killer a name. Yagami calls him the mole. Beneath the surface. All right. I think that is a great place to stop. As soon as I uh, actually get back into the game. Everyone a Kyori, man. Kumi's the most recent. And the guy who killed him all was your mole, huh? Yep. Got Kumi hand-delivered to him by Hamura. In other words, Hamura was cooperating with the mole. He might even... Might even been involved in all three cases. But Hamura kept that hidden. And ended up getting off scot-free. In turn, making us look like fools. I'm not about to let him get away with this. Agreed. You gotta go all out if you wanna win. Too bad the pay sucks. Don't hate, man. I don't get it. Why would the captain want to protect the mole anyways? He could have gotten life in the slammer if things went south. Hard to say with what we know now. First things first, we need to figure out who the mole is. That's why we're here, remember? The mole's first victim was found right in this very alley. Mm -hmm. Happened back in August. Kenkichi Mashiba, Kyore guy, 27. Pretty small time. Even lower rank than Kume. Body got reported in the room. Eyes gouged clean out of his skull. So the corpse was found pretty much the same way as Kume. Where exactly did they find it? What sort of position was he in? Not sure. Cops don't really publish those kinds of details. Well, I guess we'll have to do one better then. Hold up a sec. The cops already did their whole song and dance searching for the mole. But they couldn't turn up a damn thing. Why do you think we can do any better? Hmm. Shut up, you're making me doubt myself. Doesn't matter whether or not we can do better. We have to. 
Hama made us look like fools, and I'm not about to stand for that. Right. Anyways, the next victim was in uh, October. Wow, that's a stretch. Stretch of time. Shall we head over? I'm actually gonna head over alone, if you don't mind. Think you can get in touch with that informant in the meantime? Why I of it? If we're going to use Kaido's connections to a dirty cop, now's the time. Didn't you say something about him selling police info? If he's got info on the mole, we need it. Yep, I can ask. Thanks. All right. Um, I think I am going to quit without saving. Um, just so we can uh, start off from uh, have a little bit of uh, a refresher next time we play. Um. Thanks for coming. Uh, the VOD of, this, VOD of this will be up on my YouTube at some point. Uh, if you're new around here, you're probably watching the VOD. Uh, give me a follow. Um, yeah. Other than that, thanks for coming, and I'll uh, see you all around the graveyard.